So I'm going to do something that I have never done before, which is um, raid the character intro. But there's a caveat. I was really hoping at the character archive, right? The they have the 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 spec, the, the updated um, character um, animation, but no, they don't have it. So uh, and so as you can see, right? Uh, I don't. I do not have all of the the characters, such as the likes of Diluc, Venti, um, Klee, Albedo, Ganyu, Xiao, and uh, Yoimiya, Goro, Ito, and whatnot. So what I will do is, I will read the characters that I have first, and then. I will search on YouTube on, on reading the remaining characters that I don't have. Okay, so let's start things off with the Traveler. Uh, too simple. That was way too, too short and too simple. Um... Uh, I'm not sure if Ether's one is um, different though, but for Lumine, I'm giving her a uh, a 4 out of 10. That was way too short and too simple. Okay, let's um, continue on by order of um, appearance. Okay, next up is Amber. Cute, cute, but that, but that's pretty much it. For a character who is um, the worst free to obtain character, Amber gets a uh, four out of ten as well. It looks too, it looks too sim, too, too brief and too short. I mean, I mean she is cute, but her that character intro is way too short. Next. Next up is um, Kaya. Really? Really? Oh dear. Oh, this better. Uh, this better not. This better not tell me that all of all of the the other four star characters are getting a four out of ten for the SCA. Because I will admit that Kai is a cool looking guy, but his character Indo gets a 4 out of 10 as well. That looks so plain. That looks so plain. Next! Next up will be Lisa. Come on, Lisa, you, you better give me something or this. Come on, Lisa, you better give me something, man. You better be. Okay, not bad, not bad. I give Lisa's a seven out of ten. At least um, Lisa's and each one looks um, interesting at the very least. Unlike the past, unlike the other two free to obtain characters. And yes, just so you know, Lisa is free to obtain as well. And yeah, her 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 animation looks yeah she just she just appears uh, her the the walls comes around and she looks um she looks fine so I give um Lisa a seven not bad not bad not bad at all and in case you wanna have a look at her alternate outfit like oh I'm sorry I didn't let me let me switch to her uh, her alternate her Sumeru outfit first all right um this is Lisa Sumeru outfit. Same rating, same rating. Um, although you, although you you get to have a, a better view of her of her legs, it's still a seven out of ten. Seven out of ten. Next, okay. Next up is Barbara. Uh, I don't know, man. I mean, Barbara looks cute, but that was too short. That was too. That was too brief and too short. So uh, Barbara gets a uh, five out of ten because Bob. 
Barbara is cute, but her 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 but her intro is too brief and too sh short, and it's it's just it's just normal from the way I see it. Okay, let's you know what let's let's see if we, if her summer outfit uh, really helps. Okay, let's see if her her summer outfit really helps. No, still a five. Still a five. Even with her summer outfit, it's still a five. Oh, okay. You know what? You know, I'll I'll be generous because in the fact um, that that Barbara looks really cute in her summer outfit, I'll give this one a six. Okay, I'll just be generous and give it a six. Next, all right. The next one is Razor. Hmm. Not bad, but not that great either. Therefore, Razor also gets a. 5 out of 10 as well. Next! Okay, next one is Yang Li. Please be good. I, I, uh, uh, be because the past few uh, um, characters has been good but not great. Please, Yang Li, please be a good one. Huh! Okay, not bad. Not bad. She, she does the black. She does the black fit and she does the, the cool um, pose. I'm contemplating whether I should give it a 7 or an 8. Considering the fact that this this looks legit. Her 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 character intro looks legit cool. I will say. Uh, I'll think I'll be. I'll give Zhangli's an 8. I'll give Zhangli's an 8 then because that. That that back that back flip looks, looks great, and the back flip that she does, and then she ended it with a pose that that was too, that was way too cool. And she's cute, but she does a cool pose. Eight out of ten. And enough said. Eight out of ten. Next. All right, Bado, you're next. Uh. Really. Really? She just... She just from the... From the... She just um... Turns from the... To the... Um, from the back, she just the, turns the, to the front. That's pretty lame to be very honest. I'm sorry, Bido, um... I know what you're one of the coolest, um... Gag Electro characters are there, but unfortunately your character get intro gets a two out of ten. That was lame and boring AF. Next! Alright, since you you're up. Hmm. Not bad. Not bad at all. At least it, um at least it tells you that okay Sinchu is uh if he meets books and then that's pretty much it. I think I'll give Sinchu's a five out of ten as well. Alright, next up is Ningguang. Oh wait, I just realized that I haven't I haven't changed her outfit yet, but never mind. Let, let's just let's just see her alternate outfit. Um, the character intro of her um, alternate outfit first. Not bad, not bad. I've given Ning Wong like there's a, there's there's some elegance into it. I'll give that uh, I'll give um, Ning Wong a seven. I'll give Ning Wong a seven. All right, let's see how um, Ning Wong's character intro in her normal outfit looks like. Hmm. I think nah. So when, still a seven. Okay, she has that the elegance in the, in in her in her out in her intro, but that that that's pretty much it. It's not bad, but not that. Um, but it's not like it's not impactful. Therefore, uh, Ningguang still gets a seven out of ten. Next, all right, Chunibyo girl, you're up. Okay, not bad. Not bad. 
at least there's some uh, wee bit of um, personality to it. And she ended it with a with a post. I can't give it a point five, so I'm in. Um, I'll think I'll just give Fischl a. Uh, I'll think I'll just give her a seven. Fischl gets a seven, but um, Fischl's um, character intro is to me it's way better than um, Ming Wang. I mean I'm I'm so sorry, but. Fisher's intro looks way better and cooler, and, and she ended it with that pose. So one, so one out of ten, without a shadow of a doubt. What about her um, alternate outfit? Still a so one, still a so one out of ten. Alright, on to the unluckiest boy in uh, Genshin Impact history, Bennett. What did I just see? What the hell did I just see? Okay, you know what? For the unluckiest character in Genshin Impact history, his character intro gets a boring ass 1 out of 10. I'm so sorry, but that was lame as hell. That was lame as hell. Despite the fact that you are one of the best supporting character, you will also forever will be the unluckiest character in Genshin Impact history. And you have the most boring character intro I have ever witnessed so far. Therefore, Bennett gets the worst score out of all a 1 out of 10. NEXT! Alright Noel, you're up. Okay, she's being polite, she bounced down, and uh, that's, um, it pretty much um, screams what um, Noel is, therefore, um, it's not bad, but it just, it's just, uh, it's just not great, that's all I can say. Noel gets a, uh, I'll give her a 6. I'll give her a 6. It's not bad, but it's not great either. I mean, yeah, she, she does the bow down thing and the outfit list gives that, oh, she's she's a maid and she's a, a knight. But uh, yeah, the, and that, but still, it's good, but it's, once again, it's not, it's good, but it's not great. Therefore, Noel gets a 6 out of 10. Next, next up will be Chong Yoon. Okay, cool, cool. She he does the the yin yang thingy whatnot not and then and 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 ends it with the pose. I'll give Chong Yun a seven. I'll give Chong Yun a seven. Not bad, not bad at all. All right, Sucros, you're next. What? What was that? What was that really? Her, her flask, her, her chemical flask blew up and then that's it? Supers gets a 3 out of 10. Next! Alright, let's Jean, let's see what you got. Mm. Not bad, but not that great either. I'm sorry Jean, but... You're, you're a fine lady, but unfortunately your character intro gets a 6 out of 10 at most. I'm really sorry. Let's see if her, uh, her, alternate, her alternate outfit changes my mind. Right, let's hope um, Jean's alternate outfit changes my mind. Let's see. Okay, her alternate outfit gets a 7 out of 10. Because I will say this, Jean's alternate outfit looks so ridiculously good. Therefore, her alternate outfit gets a plus one mark for me. Therefore, her OG outfit, 6 out of 10. Alternate outfit, or should I say her summer outfit, 7 out of 10. Next! Next up will be Chishi. Found out what it was I haste 
like vegetables. What? I don't like. That's it. That was really lame. For the most hated Genshin Impact character of all time, Chichi's character intro gets a. Uh, okay, I'll be generous. A wee bit of four out of ten. That was a. That was boring, to be very honest. Next, next up will be Mona. Okay, what? She appears out of nowhere, out of nowhere, and then she ends up with a, with that, I'm fabulous kind of pose. Uh, not bad, not bad. I'll, I'll give Mona's an eight. I'll give Mona's an eight. Not bad. There's some personality in it, so I'll give Mona's an eight out of ten. Not bad. Not bad. I like it. Next up will be Kuching. Damn. That was badass. That was badass, I must say. That was badass, I will mean. I think I'll. Okay, you know what? Kuching gets a 9 out of 10. That looks badass. That looks very badass. I wonder how her other outfit looks like. Yep. Still a 9 out of 10. That, she look, Kaching looks cool and she looks badass. Therefore, Kaching gets a 9 out of 10. And so, yeah, and therefore, Kaching gets the highest, highest score for now. On to the next character, which is Diona. Okay, and at the very least, um, the, there's some personality in um, into Diona. Uh, I think I'll just uh, it's it's not bad, but not that great either. I think I'll give that Diona's at least a six out of ten. It's not that uh, at least um, at least she she ended up with that. Hmm. <laughs> So there's, there's, there's some plus points here into that, so I'll, I'll give um, Diana a 6 out of 10. Next up will be Tartaglia. Hmm. Not bad. Not bad at all. I'll give Tartaglia a Not bad. Rising Yang, you're next. Okay, at least in that sense, um, he really feels that Zinyang is a guitarist. It's not that bad, but it could be better to be very honest. I think I'll just give Zinyang a 6 out of 10. It could be better to be very honest. Next up is um, the people's favorite, um, favorite Geo Daddy, Zhong Li. What in the oh my gosh, what what in what in the oh gosh, oh my gosh, you can't be serious. Koyoverse, you can't be serious man. Geo Daddy who has one of the best um, English voice actor of all time has one of the worst character intro. Oh Worst and boring character intro. Oh my. Oh boy. Oh dear. I'm so sorry to every single Jong Leaf um, fanatics offense out there, but his character intro is is just plain. I just I just don't. It's just plain boring. I just don't see. The the I just don't see the, the, the elegance in it. It's just plain boring therefore. I'm so sorry Zhongli but your character intro gets a two out of ten. Oh my lord oh Oh Zhongli gets Zhongli is the guess the uh, Zhongli's character intro is the worst five star character intro for now. Oh my goodness. For a character who has one of the best character, then won't get the worst character intro. Like this is, oh, 
whatever. Uh, let's just keep going. Let's just keep going. I'm utterly disappointed. Next up will be Wu Tao. Damn. Damn, boy. Damn. That really screams um what kind of um person Wu Tao is. She started things off with a with a hello mother and then ends it up with a with a with that with that cute pose of hers. That really screams what kind of a person um Wu Tao is. And for that fact, right, Wu Tao gets a 10 out of 10. That, that was, that's probably one of the best um, character intros I have ever seen. I'm so sorry, Kachin, but Wu Tao gets a 10 out of 10. No questions asked. 10 out of 10. Alright, next up will be Rosaria. Rosaria, you're... I like you, you're sexy as hell, but your character intro gets a 5 out of 10 and not. I'm so sorry. I'm really, really sorry. Oh gosh. Uh, she she practically does the, the, the knife thing and then that's it. That's just plain and... That's just plain simple. I expecting I expecting something way cooler, man, to be very honest, but... Uh, that's a fun. Um, I really, Rosia, Rosaria, I really like you, but your your character in Twerk is a five out of ten at most. Next, Oi and Fei, you up? Uh, uh, I don't know, man. It's not, it's not that bad. But it's not that great either, so... Yenfei gets a 5 out of 10 as well. It looks kind of generic to be very honest. I mean, um, as a matter of fact, like... Other than um, Li the likes of um, Lisa and uh, Zhangling and Fisher, right? Majority of the 4 star um, character intro looks pretty um, generic to me. I don't know, man. Uh, I think I'll just give Yensei a 5 out of 10 at most. But character intro looks very generic to me. Next! Okay, next up is Eula. Hmm. Not bad. Not bad. She, um, she does, she does the, 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 the back pose and then she ends, and then she does another pose. Not bad. Not bad, I see. There's some ele elegance in the intro, but it's not really, uh, it's not like, it's not as, um, it's not really that impactful. It's still, it's good, it's, it's good, it's just, it's just good, but just good. Ah, good, but just good. Therefore, you lot get a seven out of ten. Enough said. Next up will be Kazuha. Damn. 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 Wow. That's badass. That was badass. He he does the, the he does the the the, the shift animation and once once he once the shift animation is done is done there's there's a, there's a, there's like there's something like a uh, a win animation um, as as a bonus. Uh, I think I give um, Kazuha a nine. I'll give her. I'll give him a nine. Look, looks legit. Looks great. Legit great. He kind of likes a wee bit of impact, but it, but still, but the but the badass V of the Kazuha is there, and therefore he gets a not Kazuha gets a nine out of ten. It's not perfect, but it's still badass. I will say this. Next up will be Ayaka. Damn. That, that, she literally screams elegance. She literally screams 
elegance. That 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 pose that she does with that fan, that literally scream screams elegance. For that, for that right, Ayaka also gets a 9 out of 10 from me as well. And you know what? Let's see how um how it looks like uh, in her fontaine outfit. Alright, let's see um Ayaka's um fontaine outfit. Hmm. I don't know about you guys, but I feel like her um her normal outfit looks way better in her, her character intro than uh, than her fontaine outfit because. Her the it does her fucking when she does the the the, the, the pose right it does in, in this outfit it doesn't really it kind of mi minus down the, the 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 elegance that she has compared to her normal outfit. I think I'll give um Ayaka some fucking outfit with the character info like uh, um. Uh, 8 out of 10, that's a minus 1. I feel like she looks way much more better in her original of in her original outfit when she, she does the her character in pro. That personal opinion in my uh, mind you by the way. Okay, next up is um Sayu. Where the heck is Sayu? Oh there you are. Bro, you 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 almost scared the living daylights out of me, buddy. You almost scared the living daylights out of me. Okay, and for that uh, and uh, for that fact, that uh, and she she almost scared the living daylights out of me, and then she ends it with the, with the ninjutsu pose. I think I for that fact, uh, I think I just give that a seven out of ten. So you get a seven out of ten. Next, next up is um, Aloy. That was lame. That was lame as hell. That was a boring ass lame intro. You know what? Aloy gets a 2 out of 10. That was boring ass lame. Next! Next up is um, Sarah. Not bad. Not bad at all, but not bad. Uh... But not that great either. I like you, Sarah, but you're you're getting a seven out of ten at most. It's not that bad. It's it's not bad, but it's just I kind of wish that I did this more of her. Therefore, Sarah gets a seven out of ten at most. Next, oh boy. Here's my here's my favorite one, and I and and I hope her one is ridiculously good. Right then, Shogun, please be a good one. Oh my god in heaven, that was so cool. That was so cool and, and badass. She really does the, the, does the same thing as she did in her character deserve where, where she where from the back she did she does a slash to the front and then and and then to top it off it pops up an electric. Oh boy that that that, that was so cool, that was so cool. Let me let me I wanna watch that again, I'm so sorry. Oh my gosh, that is so cool. You, uh, bias and bias, Rider Shogun gets a 10 out of 10. 11 out of 10. No questions asked. Bias, bias, unbiased, I don't care. Rider Shogun, 10 out of 10. Next. Okay, next up is um, Okumi. Not bad, but not that great. I don't know, man. I know, I, I, I don't know, man. I, I think I just give the uh, Kokumi like seven out of ten. Next. Hmm. <laughs> for a. 
guy who is a, a, a house husband Matthew, right? His character intro is kinda mad. Therefore he gets a 5 out of 10. I could only give it a 5 out of 10. Okay, next one is um Yun Jin. Once again, just not bad, but it's just like there's nothing much I can um, talk about her character in 5 out of 10 as well, just like Doma. Uh, Yujin gets a 5 out of 10 as well. Alright, the next one is uh, Shen He. I kinda wish that she, she um, when she she does that the the, the hand the hand gesture thing, she she does it like you know she does it like like what like one uh, uh, like a, a fast a fast one but she does it nice and slow instead. Still, I think I'll give Shin He some. I think I think I'll give Shin He like a bit. Uh, So another 10, I'll be, I'll be generous, so another 10, I'll be generous a bit, so another 10. Okay, the next one will be Yae Miko. Hmm, cute, cute, and I feel, and I feel a little bit of, um, sl uh, of uh, her slyness when, when she does that, does that pose. I'll give Yai Miko's a uh, 7 out of 10. Next one will be Yelan. Damn. That was badass. That was badass. And to top it off, um, she's um, sexy AF. 9 out of 10. With no questions asked. 9 out of 10. She's badass and she's sexy AF. 9 out of 10, no questions asked. Alright, next up is um, Hazel. Um, where is it? Oh, there you go. Mm, okay, there's, there's, some, um, there's some coolness into it. I think I'll give him a Sewen as well. Yeah, a Sewen at most. Not bad, not bad. Next up, um, this is where. I, um, we we I uh, introduced to the Sumeru characters. Ta starting things off with um, Kolei. Cute, very cute. Kind of reminds me of um, Jiang Ling's uh, intro, but in a different way. There's the, the in terms of um, the, the 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 level of cuteness. Probably because of that of the fact that she has that and uh, that she's holding the flat that piece. I think I'll give Kolei's uh, for the cuteness factor alone 8 out of 10. 8 out of 10. I I, I, I feel like Kolei, she's cute. And for that fact, she gets an 8 out of 10. Next up will be um, Tenari. Love set. Five out of ten. Next, Dory. I give Dory's a four out of ten. That was kind of kind of boring AF to me to be very honest. Next, Candace. Uh, okay. Um, she um trying to show off her her shoe is kind of cool, but she gets a 
5 out of 10 at most. Nilo, oh, Nilo, please be a good one. Please be a good one. I kind of wish it would be there's more of her from her though to be very honest because I'll be frank I really really like Nilo I really do I really like her to the extent that she's she will be the second um, character that I will C6 her without a shadow of a doubt but her character intro okay at least when she she, she does that, that dance right it, 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 it kind of it kind of tells that okay she's she's a dancer and and that the pose but still right uh... I'm so sorry Nilo I I really like you but your character into itself gets a uh, gets a seven out of ten at most I'm really sorry she gets a seven out of ten at most I get it she's pretty as f as as high but her character intro is I I I can't wish there's more. I really wish there's more. Okay, next, um, Nahida, the the wise the dendro icon and the wisest icon um to date. Cute, cute. I like it when um, she appears. Um, she's done swinging. Um, up, she comes out of her of that that the, of that seas of that swing that she she created, and then she does that she ends it with a, that cute pose of us. Um, I'll give Nahida a nine. I'll give Nahida a nine out of ten. I mean she she she's cute to top it off. So I don't I don't see why not give her a nine out of ten. All right, Leila, you're next. She does the yawn pose and then she goes to sleep. Uh, okay, uh, kind of interesting, but at the same time, it's kind of, kind of boring. Uh, to be very honest, I think I'll give Layla say uh, six out of ten. Next one is um Faruzan. Okay, Faruzan is not is not that bad, but at the same time it's not that great either. Still, if I were to rate Faruzan's um, character intro, I will give her a uh, a seven out of ten. It's it's good, but just good. Alright, they here. You're next, bro. 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 She walks right in front of you, and then, and then she does the a uh, a way weaker version of the Raiden Shogun character intro, and then that's it. Oh boy, what the, what in the oh. 3 out of 10 3 out of 10 That was That was Lame That was boring It's not cool, it's lame Dude, I'm sorry Next! Right, next up is Kave. Four out of ten. End of story. Next, all right. The last one will be um, Kirara, because I will not be rating the um, the the Fontaine characters until all Fontaine characters have been released, which is very likely um, during um, 5.0, which is next year. All right, on to the um, the last um, character that I will be judging her char the character intro, which is Kirara. Please be a cute one. At least, please be a cute one. Oh, brother. 
It's cute, but it's too simple. Like, buddy, what the hell, man? I, I was expecting more cuteness from her, but this is just too, just too freaking simple. Come on, man. I, I, I expect more from Kira Ah, oh, buddy, what the hell, man? It's cute, but it's, it's simple at the same time. It's way too simple. Like, what the hell? Uh, five out of ten. Five out of ten. That's that's the most that I can give her. That's the most I could give her. End of story. Goodbye. The end. Ah, Yoimiya. Yoimiya. Hmm. Yoimiya gets a um. Gets a seven out of ten at the most. Yeah, I get it. She 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 does the 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 fly the 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 the, 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 the fireworks thingy and then, but it's not that bad. But so not out ten at most. So not out ten at most. Next, venti. Okay, venti. Hmm. Can I watch that again? Okay, 20, I think I'll give it a uh, 7 out of 10, 20 gets a 7 out of 10. I don't know man, it's just that I, I just I just feel, I just feel like he's, um, his um, character intro is kind of like, uh, good but just good. And not to mention, and that's pretty much what I can talk about. Next. Scaramouche, okay, okay. Oh, not bad, not bad, I like it, I, I kinda like it, I kinda like it. Scaramouche, well, let's watch that again. Yeah, he, 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 sh he zooms in, he zooms in and then he ends up, ends up with the, with, with that pose. Uh, I'll give, um, Scaramouche an 8. Not bad, not bad at all. Hmm, Ito. Okay, Ito's um, intro, um, character intro is not that bad. Uh, unfortunately, um, the, the 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 Dumbus um, character in Genshin Impact gets uh, seven out of ten at most. I will admit that um, his character intro looks um, looks cool, but just. But not in, but just cool and not so uh, mind blowing and impactful. Therefore, it's a seven out of ten at most. Huh? Not bad. So I know it's not that bad. I think I'll give him a seven. I'll just give him a seven. I'll give him a seven at most. Ah, Baiju! Baiju is... Uh... Uh... No, no, Baiju's kinda... Ah... Uh, five out of ten. No, 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 I'm sorry. Le, le, le. Four out of ten. I'm sorry. I'm really sorry, but... That was so generic, it's a four out of ten. I'm sorry, but that that was so generic. It's a four out of ten. Next, ah, Xiao. Hmm, not bad. I like it. I like it where where he takes off the mat or uh, once. Uh, I like it when where where he where, where he like he half where in his character intro where. Halfway, he removes his mask to make him way more cooler. Zhao gets an eight. Zhao gets an eight out of ten. I will, uh, I will meet. It's, it, I, I mean, it's kind of, it's kind of, it's simple, but it's cool. It's a, uh, it's kind of, uh, it's kind of badass. So yeah, um, eight out of ten. Zhao gets an eight out of ten. Enough said. All right, I'll be do. Uh. 
Oh. That looks boring as hell. That looks boring as hell. Uh, I'll be though. Your character intro gets a 4 out of 10. Next! Alright, I'll hide them. Oh my gosh. You can't be serious. One of the most handsome Genshin Impact character gets the gets the lamest um character intro. This is uh, this is practically the the the, the, the same as Zhongli, man. What the hell? Oh god, what? Uh, they they better not give me the nonsense that oh simplicity is the best. No, it's not. It's not simplicity. It's not the best when it comes to character intro. It does not work that way. Come on, man. Character in character intros are meant to be like you. You want you want your characters to look as cool as possible and whatnot. And this is not cool. This is so generic and lame as hell. No. Come on, man. A hide. I mean, no homo, but a hide them is is meant to be a is a cool looking handsome looking guy and yet he gets the one of the lame a lame ass character intro two out of ten two out of ten i am disappointed with you all of us i am disappointed with you next all right ganyu uh okay this this um gun Ganyu has some cuteness um, in it. Uh, oh, I think I'll give Ganyu an eight. There's some cuteness um, in Ganyu's um, character in, um, in in it uh, intro. So I'll just give um, Ganyu an eight. Ganyu an eight. Enough said. Next. Oh. Yeah. Is it me or, or, or every single um, cool, cool looking um, male characters are getting the the the, the, the simplicity is the best um, character intro treatment? Uh. Whatever. Two out of ten. Two out of ten. Um, I'm, I am at a loss of words. Next. All right, Klee. Okay, I'll admit Klee is cute. And um, and to top it off, right? That um similar as how um Nahida and um. Gun use um, character intro is right. There's um, there's some cuteness into uh, Klee's um, character intro, and you know what? Um, I may not like Klee, but I'll give her character intro an eight out of ten. I will give um, credit where credit is due. Klee gets an eight out of ten. Enough said. Hmm, Ayato. His character intro is um uh, is not that uh is kind of cool. I I would say. Uh, but I don't know, man. But it's just like it could have been better. It could have been better. I don't know, man. I'm not. I know the. I, I know the I don't know if it's just me, but uh, but I feel like Ayato's um character intro could be way much cooler because I feel like the um, Poyovers is um, kind of holding back on his character intro or some sort. I don't know man, I, I don't know man, I really don't know. But you know what, um, Ayato gets a 6. Ayato gets a 6 out of 10. Alright, I don't have Mika. I don't have Mika but... Uh, 
Okay, Mika is definitely um, together with some of those um, major majority of the four star characters. Where um, okay, my character intro is generally as F um, a four out of ten. All right, Shinobu. Um, it's not that. It's not that bad. I think I give Shinobu a seven. Yeah, I guess she knows a seven. There's some, um, there's some coolness in in her, in that character intro, and she ended it with a a cool looking pose. Therefore, I give um, Shinobu a a seven out of ten. Not bad, not bad. Oh right, Goro. I just realized. Uh, five out of ten. No comment. Huh? Yo yo. Cute. Cute. I like it. I like it. I believe um yo yo also falls into the same um category as um the um, four star. Four star characters who, who are cute, just like um, Jiang Ling and um, Koli. Yeah, Yao Yao gets an eight as well. Eight out of ten. No, no, cute. I find Yao Yao cute. Yeah, I think that's pretty much it. I hope I didn't miss out any any character. So, which um, character has the best? Um, Character intro. I could only uh the best ones. Um, the the two characters that got a ten out of ten for me is one would be Raiden Shogun. Gosh, this is so badass. I I just I I couldn't. I just couldn't. She looks so badass. I couldn't help myself. Then the other one would be Hu Tao. <laughs> Yeah, that, that 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 scare, and then she ended it, and then she pulls back her her ghost, and then and, and then ended up with it, and she does that cute pose. I it really it really what kind of a character um Hu Tao is. So yeah, Hu Tao um another ten out of ten, and then uh, other ones like um Yelan. Yelan, um, Yelan looks, Yelan looks legit cool. And then there's um Kaching, and then there's a um Kazuha. Kazuha, this one also quite um cool looking as well. Um, Ayaka would be much better if it's um original outfit. And also, right, there are quite a few um, um, cute-looking um, character intros from the uh, the four star as well, like the likes of um, Jiang Ling, and then um, Kolei, very cute look, um, cute Lisa. Lisa's not that bad. Lisa's uh, not that bad. And then uh, they say. Um, Fisho is also not that bad. Yeah, yeah, Fisho is also not that bad. Overall, um, some are good and some are not. And just so you know, I will I will cover up to um the Sumeru characters only because um my idea is that um once all of the um Fontaine character drops, then I will maybe uh, make a uh, uh rate the character in draw for Fontaine characters only. Well, I know it's gonna be a long time but uh, we'll see how I would definitely make a uh, Fontaine character rate the character intro and yeah I think that's pretty much it.